Hello, this is Spidey1958, and welcome to my Let's Play Pathfinder Kingmaker, the release version, episode 45. I think that we're going to just kick the uh, enemies up to normal, and that which will put us in a custom mode out of the normal mode we were playing in, but I think it needs to be just a little harder. We may kick it up more if it still seems too easy. So let's go ahead and continue. Okay. It is done. So we're back on the witch's map. We talked to them up here, got the quest. We talked to the ghoul here. There's a treasure here, mushrooms, and loot there. And that looks like that down there is the village. I think we were exploring here. Did we make the edge here or what? So we know there's the big evil of the scythe tree on this map and we still need to find the witch's hut. Okay. No stopping now. Okay, looks like there's something there. I shall end this suffering. Wow, a whole bunch of stuff, but apparently there's also a ferocious warg who somehow got in the middle of our party. So you move over here and you attack there. We can do it. And it looks like there's lots of other ones around. Okay, move back here. Oh, uh, that's a greater werewolf. Okay, well that explains why there was so much gold on there. Look ahead. Thought that looked like a treasure log. And we find another ring. Probably another ring of protection. So indeed, oh this is a plus two ring of protection. So who doesn't have a plus two? You have a plus two. You have a plus one. So let's swap you out for the plus two. Get you up to 33 armor class. You only have a plus one. You don't have any. So let's give you a plus one ring. Boom. There we go. And we got a normal breastplate and a masterwork sword, so nothing thrilling there. All right, we need to be on the lookout for... Let's go ahead and give him the masterwork sword as a backup for the moment. So... Just in case he has to fight, because we had that problem last time that he had no melee weapon. Onwards. We need to give him the feet that where he can uh, shoot and melee without be creating attacks of opportunity. And then he can just basically not have to worry about it. March on. I think that's actually one of the class one of the a Haldock like treant. That is an unusual creature. Looks like it's 
going to be a dangerous creature too. Yeah, reduce damage. Wow, we missed him a lot. So he was armor class 19 was all. Oh, he wasn't that hard to hit. We must have just rolled really well, poorly. Oh, there's something. I was going to say, all that and no treasure? Well, not much of a treasure. Those are certainly something new and nasty. There's the no village. Stopping now. Which has the eerie enchanted look to it. Did we camp right next to the village? That looks like a leftover from us camping. I remember we did camp on this map. I don't remember noticing the village. your attention okay what did we see ah that's what we saw I see something done and done <laughs> I thought there was some undead near here. A specter. Let's talk to Mr. Specter. Who are you? You want to know about me? Name's Wilder. Wilder Colton. I'm the head man of this place. You're not locals, are you? Welcome. I'm dead, right? And all the rest as well. I keep forgetting. That's old age for you. Can you tell me what happened here? Happened where? Ah, the village. I something bad happened here. Problem is, I can't remember a thing. Everything was going along just as it should. I was preparing for my daughter... Nita's wedding, and then all went dark. I must have passed on before the village was destroyed. Why are you a ghost? Which ghost? Ah, right. Something won't let me rest in peace. Did I anger Estril? No, it wasn't that. Ah, I remember now. It's these lights. They're the reason. They keep creeping out of the well, whispering, hissing, and ruining my sleep. Aye, it's all because of them. Drowsy said you sold your daughter to the Fae. Is it true? Drowsy, huh? That's the one to listen to, ha. Huh? The rascal would have some tales to tell, no doubt. He was her fiancé, you see. Rich, handsome. He was courting her, and then all of a sudden she changed her mind about being wed. My Nadia went for a walk in the woods and found a new love there. One of the Fae naturally drove Drowsy into a rage, screaming the Fae had charmed her away. But think a moment. What man can compare with the beauty of the Fae? Nayette left Drowsy of her own free will. Your daughter married one of the Fae? Maybe she did. By the time of the wedding, I had passed. Since a Fae wedding wasn't unheard of here in the village, Fae lived close in the woods. Trysts happened, love bloomed, children were born. Take Elga Vernex, for instance. Her mom conceived her in the forest, her father a satyr of all things. Elga was born with greenish skin and sharp ears. 
Oh, but so sharp. Pretty she was. Wish I knew what happened to her. So there's lights coming out of a well. So where's the well? Here, well. What are we? Ah, ferocious wargs. Can we actually get to them? What for Gorum? Okay. Let's go ahead and have you go berserk. Because I quite often forget to do that. And you, go ahead and... Oh, you don't have that bow anymore. Never mind. You! You have that bow, don't you? Yep. And I think that... Except you need to move up closer. Oh, my bear is down. Bear down, bear down. Okay, let's get everyone together. Whoops, that's not what I wanted. Loot the bodies. Right here, my friend. I got everyone but the bear all the way up. Let's throw one big spell on the bear. Okay, that should get the bear back in fighting shape. And we're still looking it for a well. What's that? That's not a well. It's more token of the dryad. Looks like we can't get in there, which is fine. We don't need in there. Follow me. Not seeing a well. Maybe it's on the other side of this hut. No stopping now. This is sort of a creepy, eerie village vibe to this. Populated by nothing Stop. but Look. the occasional undead. Dizzy head. <laughs> Don't know what that is, but we found some. <laughs> I'm still not seeing a wow. I see a chest, and I see strange purple fog. Strange purple fog is probably bad. I am yours to command. Well, nothing happened so horrible has happened so far. Oh, there's something horrible happened. Let's get out of here. So is that poison? Yep, poison. So that's not good. So let's have you switch out spells. Do you have poison? Do 
protection from energy, restoration, summon, blindness, contagion, delay poison communal. So let's go ahead and memorize one of those. And I should have the same spell. Do, 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 do. Yep. Memorize one of those for me. And I believe that I have restoration as a Okay. So let's go find a place to camp so we can switch out spells. I still haven't found a well. I really haven't. Did we do this treasure chest? I don't remember. Oh, there's another one. I did as you asked. Looks like there's another treasure over there. Let's go out here in the open and see if we can like find a place to camp. Okay, let's go ahead and manage. Yeah, because use rations somehow got turned back on and we don't want to use rations if we don't have, a, have to. Okay, be interesting. You're not bad at all. Let's fight, one on one. Find out who is the best fighter on this team, huh? No need to fight. You are the best. Okay. Let's head back over here. By the duck, who is cleverly staying out of the cloud of poison. Now in beta, I think delay poison didn't work against this, so it may not work here. I don't know why it wouldn't, but Okay, you. I'm listening. Throw your new spell. Okay, now let's try going into the poisonous clouds. Oh, look! More dizzy head. So that must be the evil tree. We don't seem to be getting poison, so let's attack. It looks like there's also a level drain going on. That's not good. But it looks like we've killed the tree. Looks like there's a body here, and a body here, and a body here. Okay, and at least some, one person, uh, may have been one of the pets, got a negative level. I believe I found something. Oh look, more dizzy head. That is one really you big slug. Charge! There's more than one of them. Uh, they're immune to acid. Which makes sense, because I think they have an acid-based attack. Wow, amazingly enough, they both died. We basically want to get through here before our delay poison runs out. OK. 
Okay. More dizzy head. <laughs> it looks like that's the everything in the. Check that out. Looks like more dizzy head. Somebody must want dizzy head. Okay, looks like we have to go through here. Still haven't found this well. Okay, so there's a treasure here and a treasure there. But we can at least tell the Dryad and the Satyr that they are Druid stuff. Or not Druid, they stuff. Okay, so we killed the tree. Not a great treasure, but... So do you have anything different to say now that we killed the tree? Or are you still wanting us to mess with this well? <laughs> you have nothing new to say. So somewhere there must still be a well. I don't know well where, but somewhere. So let's for the moment head up and get the treasure we missed. And then go talk to the Dryad and her sadder lover. Tell them it's safe now. And then we will go look at the other part of the map. Why is it glowy right there? Okay. Ah, oh, we met one of these. We didn't get skinned. Okay. Now he's taken care of. And if I remember right, our friends are up here. I don't remember actually seeing her tree, though. Oh, there's her tree. <laughs> So, the scythe tree is no more. May you know peace, my queen. You have our gratitude. We don't forget your kindness. Why did she call me queen? I'm a baroness, not a queen. Though, I will be a queen someday. <laughs> Go look on her little island with her beautiful tree. Which doesn't really have anything thrilling for us. So let's go look over here. Oh, there's some more of the mud leaf. See if we can still get the horrible rolls. I think we got one out of three What's last that? time. So someone go after that. Some other way needed. And then somebody go after that. I did as you asked. Looks like a cure light, a cure moderate, and a cure serious scroll. Plus a rock. I think that's everything up here of interest. Okay. So let's go down here to the intersection. Pick up a couple more treasures and finish exploring the map. We still haven't found the witch's house. Which I think is south.
Dire bar. Tear them apart. <laughs> Let's go, boar honey. Aaron Ray, be generous to them, for I am not. So there's supposed to be a treasure near here. Supposed to be up here. Looks like more. Oh, that's herbs. Those are good. Okay, and there's something over here. Oh. Looks like we found something. I think this March is the witch. On. Okay. Let's detect magic on the gate. So the the scarecrow is very strong. Let's uh, ring the bell. What an everlasting damnation! Is she green skinned? I don't think so. So what in damnation are you doing here? I'm looking for a lost child. Have you seen him by chance? A boy? What would I do if a brat? Pickle him in a jar? That's rich. Where is it written if an old woman likes a little peace and quiet, she must be a child-stealing witch? You know what could have snatched up the children? Maybe he's been eaten by goblins or lured to the swamp by the wandering lights. Or maybe his poor sobbing mother with all her false tears strangled him in his sleep then put him to bed with a shovel somewhere deep in the forest, and now looks for someone to mantle the blame. Go to her, squeeze answers from her, make her tell what her whelp is, but don't be bothering me. Who are you? Me? I'm just a harmless old woman hoping for some peace and quiet. The old Beldane they call me, and that's fine, being called worse in my life. Why are you asking? What fool errand are you on way out here? Okay. This seems to be an unusual herb. Can you tell me what it is? You got a good eye. That herb is useful, but not by itself. Look here. This one's mudleaf, that there is gloomberry, and that, that's dizzy head. One guess what it does. If you can find three bundles of each, bring them to me. Okay. That would be a nice quest. Uh, how can I help you, good woman, since I disturbed her dress? Just look at her. She's got a question. What makes you think... I've any answers for such one, one such as you. Scrambling at my door like a beggar. Have you done anything good for me recently? You're nothing for me and you're nothing to me. Well, now you're talking. Much better than poking around where you don't belong, nattering on like a fool. Here, look. This here is black rattle cap. The spod pours inside the best things for the lungs and the skin. Me, I use them for tea. They're rare, though. They grow thickest at the mud bowl east of here. Get me at least ten. Yes, ten, and we'll talk. Farewell. So, a quest for the poor innocent old woman. What are we seeing? Oh, you. 
We need to kill you. You might harm that poor innocent old woman with the incredibly magical scarecrow. I think we need to do some healing. Confide in me. Okay. I think that, that people are mostly healed up. People and animals. Yeah, it's I think if you're going to keep pets, you need to be sure to... Uh, Keep them healed up because they are very good fighters if you spend the feats to make them so. Apparently you can't get there from here. Must be a way through there somehow though. Because I see a treasure in there. And we can't leave a treasure untouched. But it looks like we're at that wrapping up point. So as always, if you enjoyed this episode, go ahead and give me a like or a comment. And if you dislike the episode, leaving me a dislike is fine, but please leave a comment saying why you dislike the episode. As always, this is Spidey1958, and have fun gaming. <laughs>